Hey Huff, um, so I'm, I understand you're having some problems with the Susanna River problem. Um, so here you go. So one thing that I think you may have missed, and I did kind of go over it with you quickly, but when we're dealing with wind and current problems, the R takes on a new meaning, okay? So it's always going to be R plus or minus the wind or the current. It's going to be, that we're going to add the wind if we're going um, like downstream or the wind is pushing us like we have a tailwind, but we're going to have to subtract the wind or the current from the rate of the boat um, if we're going upstream and against the current because it slows us down. So R really acts like the speed in still water of the vehicle. Okay? So that might be helpful for this question. All right, so let me switch colors for you. So if I know that the rate of the Susanna, Susanna River is four kilometers, so that means upstream, um, it says that I can go one kilometer as a distance and five down. Well, that, that R for going upstream would be R minus four, and going downstream would be R plus four because the current is either pushing us or pulling us, okay? All right, and it says in the same amount of time. So we know that the time is still unknown, so that becomes our T. All right, so it becomes a little bit more challenging here. So right now I have equation one equals R minus four times T, and then five equals R plus four times T. But you have two choices. You could distribute the T. Um, it it gets, gets a little bit more complicated, but not too, too bad. But I always choose to, if I know that the times are equal, I can act, and I know that means I'm going to be setting the times equal, I don't like to distribute a, a variable through parentheses that's going to give me like a TR, a two variables being multiplied. So what I chose to do instead was to divide both sides by R minus 4 and solve for T. So now I have 1 over r minus 4 equals t. And over here, I did r plus 4. So I got 5 over r plus 4 equals t. All right, so now it's a system of equations and two variables. Since they're both equal to t, I can substitute this in for this. Let me see. Let me move up a little bit. Can I do that? All right, so now I've got 1 over r minus 4 equals 5 over r plus 4. What I'm hoping you're recognizing now is what type of equation is this. It's a proportion, and to, to solve a proportion, we can cross multiply, right? We can cross multiply. So we get r plus 4 equals 5r minus 20. I'm going to add 20 to both sides, and I'm going to subtract r to both sides. So I get 24 equals 4r, and so then r equals 6. All right, so r equals 6, and so the rate of the boat in still water is 6, was it kilometers? 6 kilometers per hour. Okay? All right, hopefully that helps you. I'm going to download it now, and let me know if you have any more questions.